So people are saying that playing Minecraft at 3 a.m. is a really weird slash scary challenge. And apparently there are many theory theories and many things and many occasions, especially YouTubers who are uploading the videos of playing Minecraft at 3 a.m. challenge. They say that essentially when you play Minecraft at like 3 o'clock in the morning, something drastic, something scary happens. See, I mean... First of all, obviously, it sounds fake as fuck. And then again, the next question is... Why the fuck would you play Minecraft at 3 a.m., to be honest? I mean, I'm pretty sure every normal human would go to sleep at... at let's say, at least 1 a.m., but... I'm pretty sure I have some videos prepared here that apparently show how scary this... 3 a.m. Minecraft challenge is. Now, I'm not quite sure if I should call this fake or not because I didn't really see what's the whole point yet. But, uh, the first video is from... It's by the guy called It's Dylan. So, uh, he made a video called the Minecraft 3 a.m. challenge. So, uh, let's see what this really means. What this challenge really is. Let's do this. Yo, what is up, guys? My name is Dylan. Welcome back to the channel. I've missed you guys. Mm, nice. Sick house. I mean, nice. Oh, I have Steve skin. What the fuck is this shit? But people want to have Steve skin. Oh, what? <laughs> Just been talking about myself, essentially. For the people wondering why I have Steve skin, I switch skins a lot for the videos. At this point, I have my skin reset. For for the most uh, for the most important video, just for free M challenge, he put a Steve skin. Suspicious. Watch closely. All right, let's see this closely. What the fuck is this? Was that there before? I don't know. What even is this? Is that a... Why, why is there a cross made out of dirt? <laughs> why is there a cross? Holy shit. Why? <laughs> Who put this here? I don't know. I mean, he didn't put it because I watched the whole thing, so you know. And what is underneath? Just more dirt, essentially. Oh! Jesus. He found the whole... What is this? Oh, it's just water. Fair enough. So he found a whole freaking cave. Jesus Christ. Well, I mean, I would be excited to see... Whoa, holy shit. Whoa. Yo, is this shit for real? I am now seriously confused. <laughs> I don't know if I should believe this shit or not, because I'm confused. This this seriously just reminds me of the old stuff that about, about Hero Brian, like how he appeared in like old older versions of Alpha. But this is what is this? Another cross. a figure at the end what the fuck is this wow sick it's a hero brian wow interesting this shit is just wow Sick. Wow. Nice. All right. Wow. Okay, 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 I'm sorry. Hi, right, let's have a little analyze here. First of all, I just still can I just still cannot be sure of the fact that this is real or not, because I mean either it can be a really well done act or it actually may be real. Oh wait. 
well, this guy called Bugs the Pirate has another thing to claim that this thing is actually real. I'm gonna watch this video because it's like three minutes long, so I guess that won't take much of my time. However, let's just see this, how real this shit really is. Sick intro. I like it. Hello guys, welcome back to the MCPE video. In today's video, we're gonna talk about... Don't play Minecraft PE at 3 a.m. And if you guys don't know, this is my new series where I will be telling you some creepy pasta story. Creepy pasta story. Creepy pasta story. I'm just gonna stop straight away right here. So it's a creepy pasta story. Well done. Case closed. The thing is fake. Why? Is because generally what creepy pastas are are basically stories that are meant to shock the reader, not actually to make a reader think this thing is actually real. So case closed. The thing is fake. And uh, yeah, that'll be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice day and peace.